Hello everyone, I'm Swizzle, and welcome back to Autonauts. So last time we left off, we just finished up getting like max storage on our logs, planks, and poles. We got charger bots on charger bots. We have bots making tools, box, bots collecting those tools. We have bots mining, bots collecting stones and sticks. And right now, we finished all our plans and we are ready to move on. So, we had to do either farming fruit or farming mushrooms. Both included a lesson, it looks like. So we held off until this video, so let's check out what they are exactly. Let's start with fruit. I don't know if we can do both, because it said we had to pick one or the other. So maybe it is we only pick one and that's it. It could be we get to pick two or do both eventually, but maybe it's just start with one right away, but we'll see. All right, click the blueprints button to access the database. Click the food button to open the section. Click the berries button to see where they come from. Berries come from berries. What? Hello? Oh, you've guessed it. You use a stick or a flail to beat a bush to release the fruit. All right, so stick plus bush equals fruit. Interesting. All right, is that is that was that the whole lesson? That was the whole lesson? All right, um, I guess it's a good thing we're collecting sticks then, huh? So let me see, give me a stick. Let's see what this all is all about. All right, so we got a stick, and let's whack the bush. All right, interesting. Nice technique, love it. All right, we got a berry, now what? Oh, let's track it. How do we track it, how do we track it? There we go, pin it, pin it, pin it. Berries released, 1 out of 20. Berries planted, berries stored. Oh, so we can plant berries. Wait, how do we plant berries? Do we get... I'm so confused. So we have a berry. We can put it into storage, but how... Oh, the bushes don't disappear. So I'm guessing a new set of berries will come out. Can we, like, replant these? How does this work? We gotta do some testing. Let's see. So let's get a spade and let's dig right here. So let's see, let's pop that down. Wait, what is this? What is this? We have a chunk of grass. Oh, we can beautify our, our little colony. Oh boy. I wish I didn't find that out. I'm going to want to fix everything. Oh boy. So let's dig a hole. Let's see how we make a bush. I don't even know if we can. Maybe I'm missing something. That's a... Don't don't sit in the hole. What are you doing? Okay, can this go in there? Uh alright. Oh, okay, yeah, so that's what we do. So it's like a I guess like an endless cycle that we can have out of these where we can just like use a berry to make a bush. And then that bush will infinitely spawn more berries that we can use to make infinite more bushes. All right. So that works out well. So maybe let's get a plot of land for bushes for berries. Let's see. Ooh, you know how we should plan it. Let's do based on a bot's area size. So how are we going to do that? Let's see. You know what? Let's get a bot made. We are going to need at least three bots for this. We're going to need a bot to beat the bushes to release all the seeds or all the berries. We're going to need a bot to then... Oh, we're going to need four bots. We're going to need a bot to dig holes and then a bot to plant the berries, a bot to collect the berries. That seems about right. I guess, though, planting the berries is a one-time process because once it's done, it's done. So maybe that's something we'll just do by hand? Oh, took too many poles. All right, I'll put those back. Hey, yeah, put them back. No, put them back, don't take them. And now we need a seed. Ooh, that's something else we should do. Maybe we should do that first. Maybe we should have a bot collecting seeds. And then instead of a bot... Oh no, I think our charger bot died. Nothing's getting charged because our charger bot died. Oh boy. Where's our charger bot? There he is, cranker bot. Get back into the game, boy. 
There we go. So we should probably actually get a bot that's collecting these seeds and just throwing them into storage because then our seed planter bot can instead of searching can just get straight from storage. That might be a more elegant solution. And then that way we have an easy spot for us to get seeds out. So let's do that. Let's make, let's make some storage real quick. Let's make a crate. How about, how about, sure, right here. So we need four planks, four poles. Easy enough. One, two, three, four. And four planks. Wow, we're almost full on planks already. All right, so we need the seed collector bot. And where are you? Tree planter bot. There we go, so. Use held on, okay. Stop there, that's perfect. So instead, what we're gonna have you do, actually, let's put a seed in here real quick. So what we will have you do is record me. Okay, that's all we need it. So we can instead get rid of find nearest tree seed and move the tree seed and pick up tree seed. We can now instead take it from storage, find a hole, and then use it. All right, so that's good. And now we need, so because now this bot is solely collecting from storage, we need a bot that is gonna collect all the seeds instead. Wait, why aren't you moving? Take from seed storage. Oh, there's none in there, all right. So this is gonna be, all right, come on. There we go. Tree seed collector. And you are gonna go into the forestry team. Now watch me. Pick up a seed. And then throw it in. And actually what we want to do, we want to do the same thing where it is until hands are full, we will pick up tree seeds. And then we'll move them to storage and add them all. And then go for it. That should be good. Should collect about three or four tree seeds, I'm guessing. Let's see, that's one. Check his work. Two. Come on, buddy. Three. Ooh, just three. Not going for that promotion, are you? All right, let's put that in there. And then that one took a seed out and is going to go plant. Perfect. Now, one thing I noticed is that from digging, it looks like things kind of pop out randomly around where the tree was. So if the area is only up here and stuff pops out to the north, it's never picked up. So maybe for the bushes, we take the max area and we can find the bushes to be like one smaller on each direction so that way if berries pop out in any direction they can always be picked up i think that's probably a smart idea and let's see can we move through bushes? we can move through bushes so there's nothing no issues with spacing most likely so we are going to need another bot then since i use that bot to collect all the seeds see there's a log how many logs do we have? Only 11 still. Oh boy. Logs are kind of becoming a hindrance if we start running low on them. So eventually we're probably going to need another forestry team. Three planks, a pole, and a seed. And now we can just get seeds from here. Beautiful. There we go. And a seed. Nice. Oh, oh, what we have to do, we have to expand the area. We did not expand the area, I don't think, for the seed collector. All right, so let's do that real quick. Wait, there you go, seed collector. Stop. And we need to edit. Wait. Where did we do it? No, oh, we got the wrong one, okay. So where's the seed collector? Hello? Am I missing something here? Uh, seed collector, hello? Where are you? Move to tree seed. Oh, wait. Oh, there you are. Yeah, the area is small, so we do have to expand this. So let's stop that and expand it. And I think that should be good. 
And go for it. So now they'll collect these. Because these were all just sitting there. All right. So now I got an extra bot here. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on here? Excuse me? Why are you over here? Find near. Oh, you're stuck. Uh. So I guess let me take what's out of your hand. Can I? How do I do this? Can I pick you up? I thought I could pick you up. Let me help you. I know I could do something with their hands, right? Bot trade. There we go. Give me your seeds. One. Out of throw range. Wait, where'd you go? What are you doing? Okay, you're just a terrible worker. Terrible. All right, so we got this bot. So this will be... You know what? All we need to know right now is a max size. I really don't feel like counting. Is there an easier way? I definitely want it out here, though. Let's see, let's put the bot down. So an easiest way to do this is probably going to be to, like... To so the easiest way to do this is probably going to be do something like this. Let's stop. Let's see the max area. There we go. So let's do... Oh, wow. That's a huge area. Okay. So maybe... Oh, maybe up here. Because there's a lot of dirt over here, and I would rather... We use that for trees and stuff. Although there's dirt, there's open grass here. It's just not uncovered. Well, that's fine, actually. So let's position it like... Oh, I can't move it over because it's not co uncovered. Interesting. That's a weird choice. Ah, oh, we got mushrooms here. How do I pick these up? Oh, I stick them, I guess. Is that what we do? We just stick them? All right. But then how do more grow? Because it doesn't look like there's anything left there. Ooh, we're going to definitely have to do the lesson on this one. Oh, don't put that stick down. There you go. Stick there. Let's take these mushrooms. Just move on out of the way. All right, so this bot. So the max area is, let's say... So like I said, we're going to do one in from the corners. So that way if berries pop out to the left or above, bots can still be in the range to collect everything. So let's see, a stick is going to have to go under this row, but parallel or in the same row as this. So let's mark that. So it'll be here. <laughs> I guess we'll use the mushrooms to mark. And there. That's a pretty big area. Oh my God. All right. Okay, so that's a that's quite a big area. Oh, that's going to take a long time for us to dig by hand. We might actually just want a bot to help us with that. Oh, but bots have to dig twice, don't they? Because it digs up, like, the grass first, and then it digs a hole? Why? Why would that be a thing? All right, let's have you be the turf digger, I guess. Let's see, turf, digger, and let's delete out this. Okay, so what are we gonna need? You're gonna need, actually, so the first thing is, follow me and you will pick up a spade, correct? Yes. So that way if they run out, this bot can know to come back to pick up a spade. So that's fine. Now we'll drop that back down. And let's throw that in a loop until, let's see, a forever loop until hands are full, it's going to dig. And then once the hands are not full, it's going to go back and look for a spade. So now we can record the rest of it. Oh no, we need a spade for that. There you go. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't need all this. Nope, 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 nope. Stop it, stop it. Stop it. No, stop. Oh God. Stop. Stop everything. There we go. No. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here. No, stop it. I just want to click the move. I don't want you to dig. 
Okay, so here we go. So now I'll go here and find nearest turf, move to turf, use item. Perfect. So until my hands are... Wait, no, we want until hands are empty. Because once our hands are empty, we need to go find a new spade. There we go. And then let's edit the area. And this entire... Ooh, wait. So we need to shrink this a bit. There you go. And then... I guess we just play it, right? Let's see if this works. Oh, boy. I didn't give him the spade fast enough. Hurry up. Put it on the pile. There you go. So let's watch. Let's see if this works. Oh, we're probably going to need a turf collector now. Ugh. It's like every little thing you're like, oh, this should take like one bot. Turns out it needs, you know, four. Because why not? Oh, wow. That takes a while. Oh, my God. It's like a 20 second process for one piece of turf. Okay, so now we need a turf collector and we need another one to dig holes. Oh no. So let's build more bots. More bots, more bots. Uh, took too many poles, but we need two bots at least, so. There's one. And a log. Three planks and a seed. I feel like this bot creator should be centralized because it is kind of a hassle to walk back and forth nonstop. And then one seed. We only have four seeds, really? I guess we're planting a lot of trees. There we go. So before we get started with that, we need another storage, I guess, for turf, right? So, storage for turf. I'm assuming turf will go in a crate. I hope. Actually, we can hover it. Yep. Goes in a little crate. And we can just put it right here. That's fine. Four planks, four poles. Easy enough. Two, three, four. And add it to the pile. Hang them in those poles. Three, four. Actually, he's making decent progress. It actually may not take that long. So now you, Mr. Bot, up here. Oh, I got to charge you first? Uh, I should have did that earlier. All right. Ooh, our stones are full. We're going to have to increase storage on these for sure. So this is going to be Turf Collector. Now watch me find turf in this area. And we're going to have to do the same thing where we do it until your hands are full. Just so that the bot can collect three or four at a time. And then deposit it. Now we'll do a loop. Do it forever. And then until your hands are full, you're going to keep on finding stuff and picking it up. In this area. Dunzo. Go forth! Collect! Let's see how well that works. Let's get this stick out of the way. And actually, we can get these mushrooms out of the way since we already have the area defined. Nice, look at him go. Oh no, we're gonna have so much turf. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a second. Oh no, that's what's happening. That's why we have no seeds. He's collecting three, but then he's only depositing one at a time. That's not good. Stop. Okay. So move to storage, add to storage. Okay, so we need another loop. So until hands are empty. Wait, no. Move to storage and then until your ads are, hands are empty, add everything to the storage. Yes? All right. So let's see. Your hands are full. Move to storage. Now deposit all. There. Perfect. Nice. So now we need to change that for... I guess every collector we have, right? 
Especially the tree seed collector. Let's see. Cord. Oh no! Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Until hands are empty, add to storage. Go. Go forth. Wait, why didn't this... Did I not save the area? I must have not have. Maybe I didn't click apply. What happened? Actually, I think that's off again. One to the right. There we go. That's why we have no seeds. I don't think I hit apply. Okay, so that should be good. And we might just want to expand this to max. Because look at this. We're already at 16. So let's, let's just stack this three high. So we're going to need eight planks, eight poles, which we have a ton of. So not a big deal. Two, three, four. I really wish I could hold more. I really hope that's an upgrade, like a backpack or something. Bigger backpack. Because right now, backpack's just carrying one axe, and that's not really helpful. Bunch of trips just to get this storage all set. Two, three, four. And then we need to do it again. So what's going on with these miners? Why are you stopped? So clearly there's nowhere else to dig, so I get that. And what are you doing? Why are you just staring? Oh, is that a, oh, that's the cranker bot. Because this one's not working, it's not running low energy, so this has nothing to crank. Makes sense, makes sense. It's really hard to keep track of what's what. I have so many bots, they're just multiplying. All right, and this should be good. Oh no, ran out of power. I think we can just manually watch these at this point in time. I don't know if we need a cranker bot for down here. All right, so we should be good with this. It's a lot of turf, you know what? Because this is bugging me, let's fill this in. Much better, much better. All right, so where are we at? Berries released, so we're not doing anything yet. We're still working on getting berries, okay. So now we need a bot that is gonna dig out the holes for this. So let's make another bot, shall we? There we go. So we need a bot that's gonna dig the holes. And then we can probably plant the berries ourselves, I'm thinking, instead of wasting another bot for that. Or maybe the bot that digs the holes, once they're done, will repurpose them to then plant all the berries. That might be the best course of action. I keep grabbing too many poles. All right, let's just put the poles down. Just leave them. Nice. All right, how we doing? How we doing? All right, crank you. And you are gonna be... Wait, no, put them down. Hole digger. Berries. All right, so watch me. You need to get a spade. Hey, you took my spade. All right, we gotta wait for this to be made. That's actually really nice. That is working out really well. So move to spade, pick it up. And then I guess we'll just have him watch me continuously. Then go over here, dig this. I hope that changes to like find an area. Oh, I clicked wrong. Whoops. Okay, get out of the hole. I don't know what your fascination is with being in the hole. There we go. So now let's figure this out. So let's record. So we don't need that. We don't need a drop. So we're definitely going to need another loop. Until hands are full. Let's see. Find nearest soil in an area. Move. Use soil. When your hands are no longer full, go find a spade. Okay, perfect. So max area. Actually, we don't want the max area. We want like that. Right? That should be good. We can actually line it up with the turf builder or the turf digger. 
Let's see, Turf Digger. As soon as he's done with that one. Okay, so what's your area? Goes down to right above this little tile. So, let's check. Hole Digger Berries. Wait. Oh, until hands are empty, duh. Oh, that's fine. Oh, the area is too big, okay. Max area. No, wait, no, 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 no. We gotta bring this in one, and we gotta bring this in one. That's what it is. That should work. Wait, don't, no, until hands are empty. Empty, empty. There. Now you're gonna dig? Dig for me. We should probably increase storage for stones and sticks since these are kind of being bottlenecked right now. Actually, let's stack these. How high can we stack these? Is there a limit? Oh my god, I don't think there's a limit. Alright, that's fine. I don't know how they're going to reach those, but you do you. So let's, in the meantime, I guess let's just get rid of these berries. Ooh, here's a question. Here's a question. Can I... I want to put this pickaxe back just so they use it. Let's take a spade. Can I dig up this berry bush? Like, can I transplant this over here? Or at least get berries out of it. I'd be fine with that. Nope, we just completely got rid of it. All right. Don't do that then. Okay, good to know. Let's just hit some bushes. We're definitely going to clear them out though. Just because I want to clear out this area. And maybe that's what we'll do. While these ones are digging and doing their thing. We will worry about collecting berries. We got to go charge this one. And this one. Oh boy. We need more charger bots. Charger bots are at least nice because they're not using power while idle. So at least, unless they're currently actively charging someone, they're not wasting power. So it does take them quite a bit to run out of power. So I may just want to start loading up on charger bots because it's easier for me to charge like three or four bots instead of having to worry about every single bot. But we will see. Maybe we'll do that in a later episode. I don't feel like tackling that at this moment. Let's take these berries. And you know what? Let's plant these now. Wait. Why can't... Why aren't you digging every hole? What is going on? Wait, what is going on? Why can't you dig every hole? Okay. Stone collector, charge you up. I'm so confused. Why can't you dig every hole? What's going on here? Oh no. Find near soil. There's soil right there. Dig it. Do it. Why is it doing every other one? Excuse me? Oh, that is not good. I guess we could do that ourselves because it would just be every other hole. Because I don't think there's an issue with them going through bushes. I've seen them do it. Alright, let's take some turf. Let's just clean this up. It's going to bug me if we don't. I wish it was this easy to do landscaping. It's nowhere near this easy. You know what? And this little blueprint is bugging me as well. Go away. There we go. And we got our mountain of little pickaxes here. So what do we want to do? What do we want to do? Let's collect more berries. Where's our stick? Good old stick. Let's clear out these three berries. And... Ooh, what is this? Wildflowers. Hmm. wonder if that's for anything. Or maybe it's just decoration. I'm sure there's some use for that in the future. Come on, dig faster. No, don't dig there. Don't dig there. No, stop it. Stop it. Stop. Why do you keep doing everything? That's a minor annoyance. Every time I want to just click to move, because click to move is left click. But if you do it with a tool, I just always want to dig a hole. I don't want to dig a hole. I just want to move. 
But then if I right click, you drop your tool. It's like, what are you supposed to do? I guess you are supposed to put it in the backpack. Maybe that's it. It just seems a little counterintuitive. All right, let's dig up that bush. And we will dig up this other bush. Come on. Should just take a long time. Wake up, chickens. How much turf are we at? 41 already. All right, so let's swap this. Drop our stick and pick up these berries and go plant them. All right, so let's plant one there. And one there. And one there. Let's patch those holes. Gotta take care of our yard. All right, so what else? I really need to figure out if there's a way to make them dig every spot. Because digging every other does not seem really effective. I get it. It's probably for, like, the trees. Maybe trees can't grow next to each other. What's going on here? Crankerbot's dead. No wonder. Get back in it. Yeah, so maybe trees don't grow if they're right next to each other. So maybe it's just programmed like that. Or maybe it's a, like, bot upgrade to, like, dig every hole. Maybe it's, like, an efficiency upgrade? So let's take this stick and let's clear out these berry bushes and plant them. And actually, let's... We probably want to throw these into a group, into a team. Turf digger and turf collector. I may want to just keep those separate because they're not just going to be for the berry team. They're going to be for anytime we want to dig up turf. All right. Wait, what happened to our stick? Oh, our stick died. No, we broke our stick. And it doesn't look like there's a correlation between size of the bush and the amount of berries we get. We always just seem to get a one-to-one. -one. So I guess that's just an aesthetic thing of how big the berry bush grows. Doesn't seem to affect anything. Let's drop the stick. Let's dig these bushes up. Just to get everything nice and neat. And actually, I might put turf into these areas. Just so that I have a very defined forestry area. It might help me more visually to see kind of what's going on. Because right now, this is just in shambles. I don't know what's going on here. These are a bunch of messy workers. All right, everything's good here. Oh, ran out of power. That's not good. We're going to need a cranker bot for sure. Another cranker bot down, down south. Ooh, actually, the cranker bot that's here, maybe I can have them overlap down here for the time being. Let's check that after I dig up this one last bush. Let's see, that's going to be charger bot two. Let's see, is it charger bot two? Nope, it's three. All right, so let's stop it and let's edit the area. Eh, it'll kind of work for now. It won't last for long. So let's put the shovel away and let's collect our berries. Wait, our berries disappeared. Aw, are you kidding me? Okay, don't leave food on the floor. Note it. But our mushrooms didn't disappear. I call foul play on that one. All right, so we got some berries growing. And let's see. I think we are kind of good for now. Oh, let's charge you. Who are you? Where's our cranker bot? What are you doing? Cranker bot, you're sleeping on the job. Oh my God. He, he actually died in that thin strip. Wait, you're in the area. Why aren't you being charged? I think it thinks it's in this tile set right in the middle. The one thing I said would not happen actually happened within like 20 minutes. Are you kidding me? Okay, we're going to have to do a network of charger bots because I am micromanaging these charging, these, all this charging right now, and I'm going to have to fix that. So we will do that next time. I'm just going to get a string of charger bots. So plan on that for the next episode, and I will see you all next time.